Hello, Paul Richards here with PTZ Optics. Today I'm excited to talk to you about a brand new telemedicine case study that we have between PTZ Optics and Protexa Healthcare Technologies. Protexa has a brand new robotic intelligent telehealth assistant, short for RITA, which uh, we have right over here. And RITA is a platform that fosters integration of multiple healthcare technology components through a common user interface to provide secure and scalable delivery at care at a distance. RITA is a world-class state-of-the-art technology made in the USA. Uh, Protexa is actually based in California. Um, it's designed to improve physician productivity up to 30%. And RITA is designed to work seamlessly across all telemedicine um, solutions and platforms. Um, as you can see, um, this case study, as we're going to show you in a moment here, uh, actually has a real deployment uh, to critical access hospital facilities in rural Kern County, California. And that's actually being rolled out in Lake Isabella Critical Access Hospital. And uh, we're going to show you a couple different doctors, Dr. Gross and a few others, who are actually using RITA today in a real telemedicine uh, health uh, application. So this has been a great case study because PTZ Optics has been selected as the pan, tilt, and zoom camera inside Rita. And there's a few reasons for that. One, Protexa needed 1080p high definition video crystal clear for the doctors. So when they're zooming into a patient to look at a mole or an abnormal situation on a human body, that the actual representation was uncompressed 1080p video, which can only become uh, from a a USB 3.0 pan tilt zoom camera. Also, Protexa is using PTZ Optics' UVC control capabilities. That means uh, Protexa only needs one USB cable for full pan -tilt zoom controls of the camera. Then finally, Protexa has worked with PTZ Optics to build the pan tilt and zoom controls directly into their HIPAA compliant telemedicine interface. So, therefore, doctors have no other boxes or places to go other than basic telemedicine software from Protexa for all of their video, audio, screen sharing, and pan, tilt, and zoom controls of the camera, all in one interface. So we're going to show you a few videos of it live, in action. This is a really important case study for the telemedicine industry. What happens when somebody comes into the emergency room and says, I'm having chest pain, is they immediately wheel back to get an EKG. If we can make that diagnosis of, a, of, a, of an acute MI, or what we call ST elevation MI, we've got a certain period of time to get them from here to a cath lab and get them thrombolyzed for complete reversal of an MI. And so that's why this, this along with the, uh, yeah, this so, device so this here. Go, these are all touchscreen monitors. Over here on the left, lower one, is the Rita control panel, which uh, we, we've, we've tried to sort of mimic Apple in that it's simple, you know, single button pushes to do something. So I, I just push this monitor, which I'll explain later. It, it raises and lowers, it makes it more stable when you're, when you're transporting it around. Over here is the screen where the, um, the remote physician will show up. Now on the physician side, you know, they have a PC or, or tablet or whatever where they see the patient. And they see the patient through this camera, it's a high resolution camera that the patient, I'm excuse me, the doctor operates remotely. The, the pan, tilt, and zoom as we call it. And I'll, I'll demo that here in a minute. Um, or track it up when you don't want it. Uh, when you want it, you, you, you know, push this button and the twist throttle, you know, giving the, the motion. When you don't want that, you push this, it tracks up the drive wheel, and now it's just six casters and it can be moved you know, in any direction quite easily. So kind of the idea is, you know, when you're wheeling down the hospital, um, the hallway, you can probably use the power button. But uh, when you get it next to the patient and you want to do a fine adjustment of that, um, then you, you, you retract this wheel and go with this, this manual mode, as we call it. 